<clears throat> so, chat, this is Choo Choo Charles. This is the same maker as, um, something else. I just realized something. This, this is Choo Choo Charles. It's the same creator as uh, Snake Hotel. No Snake Hotel. Sorry, there are no snakes at that hotel. Um, this is... Um, I don't know. It's a game of the train. That's us I know it's been a while since we last spoke, but something has happened at the mines I've been supervising. No, trust me, you'll want to make time for this. You're looking for something big to keep your museum in business? Well, there's something big on that island. Real big. So many friends, and even my own son are still out there. If anyone can bring this thing down, it's you. It'll be the biggest attraction your city's ever seen. And you can help an old friend. Yes, meet me on the docks at sunset. I don't trust I this guy. You're ready for a little monster hunt. I don't trust this guy. No, no one would be hyped about helping his friend out with his museum. And meanwhile is like, yeah, this thing happened to take my son. It's fucking amazing. He was too happy about his yes, son sir. being lost. They call him Charles. Half train, half giga spider from hell. We've been planning his demise for some time now, and have nearly everything in order. Sorry. Just a few people to meet and places to see. Symbol errands, you know. So it's open world. <laughs> yes, sir. Welcome to Erinirum, the island where miners dig their own graves. Stay close. Charles isn't the only thing to fear around here. Is this an open world horror game? I have nothing more to lose here. I've made up my mind to swim to the mainland, or to at least try. I likely won't make it, but still. I see my chances being higher out there than on this forsaken rock. Sorry. <laughs> it's the classic getting everything working properly before we play. Would you do your clone? Forty two percent said no. How many said yes? Are majority saying yes? Why? There's a train shed at the top of the hill. Okay. One of the train operators was killed early on by the beast. So his old engine should be in there. If we can get to it, it could be an indispensable tool on our journey. Stay close. We don't want to be exposed for too long. Keep up with the Eugene by sprinting. Oh wow, okay. Dude, this is he's fast for an old man. Hold on, man, there's something here. No, never mind. Oh god, he's out of here. Wait! Eugene! <clears throat> I'm telling you, man, Eugene's setting me up. leaving. <laughs> okay. Alright, Eugene, let's do this. Ah, oh, shucks, it's locked. Not to worry.
worry, we can still find a way in. There's a small shack up the path that might have a key inside. Take this map, I just marked the location on it. See if the key is up there, and I'll look around some more down here. Map. <laughs> what the fuck? Blue arrow marks your location, white lines mark the train track. What the fuck, dude? Okay. Oh, it's a little laggy. Uh... Red arrows mark splits in the track. NPC submissions are marked on the map. Place waypoints to make traveling easier. Look inside the nearby shack for the key to the train station. Baby's first mission. We like me here? I don't know if we like me here. I don't know if we like me up here, no. Okay. Hello? It's a big key. Waypoint? Oh, right. Is that audio a little like <laughs> for you guys? <laughs> <laughs> Good on you! Looks like you found it! Open up that door and lead the way! Yeah, it's like crackly. <laughs> How's the game looking for you guys? Looking okay? There's no frame stutters or whatever? Or frame flutters? I was I forget what they're called. Wait, Tio, did you buy this game? Oh yeah! I did. Alright, chat, we have a code we can give away for this game. <laughs> Hobo got me a code, I forgot. <laughs> Hey, yeah, we'll do a giveaway. May as well do it now before the game starts. No, it's okay. I don't mind supporting the developer. Holy shit. Your epic train. Use it to quickly navigate the island. A weapon and shield against your foes. Your respawn point if something... If things go wrong. Interact with items around the cab to learn about using them. I don't know if it's a public code. Really? What? Why not? Oh, it's okay. It's got like a custom Tio skin and stuff. <laughs> so. Upgrades. You can upgrade it? Oh shit, okay. Fuck, I didn't read on the left. What do I upgrade it with? Scraps. Yeah, he loves you long. What the developer? Now nah, he would have said it was a, if it was a special special code. Now I'm worried. <laughs> I'm pulling up the email one sec. Alright, we'll wait a little here. Make sure that it's not a special code. It's looking good so far, though. <clears throat> I love the idea of this turret at the back. It 
it was a pre-launch key that would give you full access, it should be fine. All right, cool, giveaway time chat. Before we get started here with the train, one of you lucky little bastards is gonna win the game. Uh, win a code to the game. In chat, you will post the word once I let you know. It's PC. Okay, hobo. Write hobo in chat. No, 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 the word's not PC. <laughs> I was answering someone. The word's hobo, chat. <laughs> I swear, these guys are a bunch of drones. <laughs> <laughs> Such idiots. <laughs> uh, that reminds me of like rush hour. It's like It's you Me? No, what's his name? His name is you. You see they're making a rush hour four? I you know I, I choose to have hope about it. I choose to have hope about it. Yeah, they're bringing back, uh, from what I read, they're bringing back uh, both of them. Chris Tucker, Jackie Chan. I reckon if they lean into them being old, I think it could be funny. Tucker Carlson? Isn't that that, like, Fox News guy? His name's Chris Tucker, no? Someone just said, sounds awful, will Tucker Carlson be there? Is his name not Chris Tucker? What's his name? <laughs> his name's Chris Tucker, yeah. Who's Tucker Carlson? Isn't that the Fox News guy? Or am I thinking of someone else? All right, the winner is... Oh, nice reply. Yeah, that's nice. I swear I, I see him. I see him in chat uh, quite often. That's good. Congratulations. I don't know why it said hobo cutie at the end. At first, I thought hobo won the giveaway. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's play. Hi, Martio. It's okay. You can stop clicking uh, forward ten seconds. We're playing. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. This guy kind of looks like Sully from um, Uncharted. We were talking about him earlier. She's an oldie but a goodie. I'm going to inspect the train's exterior. Why don't you take a peek inside, see what we got to work with? I feel like I want it louder. Let's get it loud here. Yeah, I mean, I've already looked, man. Yeah. Look to aim. Use your action input to fire. Jesus. Guns will get briefly jammed from overuse. So this is if I don't move my m mouse. It's got quite some recoil. New guns can be earned from missions. Oh, hello. Well, the exterior is a little rough, but everything looks to be intact. That gun you were looking at wasn't on here when I was evacuated from the island, but it sure Hey, Toenail Smoothie. Thanks for subbing, man. <laughs> you missed me thanks to the gifted sub. So who added the gun? We can light up Charles with it and take him down before he even sees us coming. Are you ready this to take lifeless. this thing for a spin? Uh, operating the train. Central lever moves the train forward. Left lever moves the train backward. Right lever stops the train. Leaving the train while it's moving automatically stops it. What? Yeah, okay. baby! We're coming for you, Charles! Hear that? Oh it shit, he's him. already here! Okay. Get to the gun! Add him up! Add him up! Careful! Don't let the gun over 
overheat. It's already overheated, man. Where's my? How do I? No, Sully. What? Okay. Well, that didn't take long. <laughs> how do I leave? Okay. Well, that was like eight seconds after I said it. Did I say it or did I just think it? Am I meant to go to him? Oh, maybe he, may, yeah, maybe he has a line. Sorry. <laughs> I, just, I just leave. I don't even react. <laughs> no, Sully. Uh, anyway. <laughs> I'm coming, buddy! Don't! <laughs> this isn't how things were supposed to end. Eugene, that's your name. Oh, he does care about his son. You know, it was a better death scene than, um... What's her name in The Dark Knight uh, Rises? Her death scene was one of the most awful death scenes I've ever seen. I don't know why they chose that... That cut. No, not Rachel, guys. The... The... Uh, 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 Talia. Talia Al Ghul, yeah. Goodbye, old man! Hold on, can I... Oh, shit. Stop, 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 stop the train! I want to remove this waypoint, man. Oh, I regret the day that I added a waypoint. It's always gonna be on screen. Yeah, I can't remove it. Okay, cool. So, where are we going? Uh, ooh, lots of people. Optional mission. Required. Weapon mission. Alright, fuck it. <laughs> we'll use the waypoint. Uh, is there a, a loot box? Almost said I'm missing something. Oh! Scrap! Let's, uh, bring the damage up. Armor. I looked it up, you have to go into the save files and reload the game to get rid of it. Yeah, it's almost worth it, man. I don't... It's kind of immersion breaking. I'd rather just look at the map and not use the waypoint. So who lit this fire? that earlier and it wasn't working. Thanks. Stop! 
Ah. Oh my god, no, the waypoint's still there. <laughs> come back to haunt me. Told us we'd have a newcomer soon. I suppose that would be you. Is Eugene the old man? There's some scrap metal in the balcony room of my house that you could use to repair and upgrade your train. Here's the key. And although the balcony is right behind me, I'll just mark it on your map anyway. As a side note, talk to anyone around here, and uh, they'll do whatever they can to help. Anyone not wearing a mask, that is. Check out the balcony and. Take whatever you can eat. Good luck with everything. Wait, what? Are, why no one? What does a mask mean? You have some resources, you can go back to your train and make some upgrades. We've been waiting as patiently as we can, but the past few days have been chaotic to say the least. Charles has been more aggressive lately, to the point where I'm starting to fear how many of us will be left by the time help arrives. Godspeed, Eugene. We're counting on you. I'm the hero? Oh. Oh, Okay, now that I'm done with you... What are you? Game looks really good. Ah, fuck! Didn't realize I would use all five. No, hey, chat, you... I'm not saying that I'm Eugene. I'm saying that I'm the hero that Eugene brought back. What's that beeping? Oh, it's a bird. Is it a bird? I think it's a bird. That's a cricket? No, that's not a cricket. <laughs> I've had, oh, hello. I've heard many crickets in my day. That is not, that's not a cricket. Look, kid, I know you're supposed to be some fancy pants monster hunter, but you can't earn my respect without making yourself useful. One of Warren's goons dumped a locked chest in the yard last night. After beating on it for a few hours, I didn't break anything but a sweat. I got some lock picks, but 
I don't know how to use them. Here, take them. If you can get that chest open, you'll earn my respect. And I might just give you some scraps. Okay, this way. A very old stone tablet that features some strange drawings. <laughs> well, fancy fingers here got the chest unlocked. <laughs> easy. Uh, that's an odd looking piece of junk you found inside there. Bit of a letdown, to be frank. You earn my respect. So here's some scraps. Twenty-eight scraps. I'm gonna save some. Wait, hold on. Where am I going? Required mission. Weapon mission. Hello! The monster hunter has arrived, I see. This is no ordinary hunt, mind you. We've already tried fighting Charles, but he retreats into the wilderness if he is sufficiently harmed. We believe there may be a way to get Charles to commit to a mortal battle, however. I gotta cover myself in blood. Dispersed around the island are three eggs, locked in the island's three primary mines. Our theory is that putting these eggs in the temple at the center of the island will provoke Charles into a fight to the death. That is some theory. How did you how did you come to that theory without trying it? The mining company how do you know owner this? Warren Charles III has placed armed guards inside each mine to protect the eggs. There's an egg in the mine just down the rail. Here's the key to the mine. I've marked the entrance on your map. Uh, armed? What, I'm just fighting people with a weapon? The mob? <laughs> Alright, let's go get this new weapon over here. Thrower as an addition to my spider train home defense plan, but as you can see, it is slightly uh, backfired. <laughs> Nearly cooked myself alive in that shed as I was testing it. Shoot, dang. I would love to save the shed, though. If a uh, flamethrower somehow still works after the fire dies down, well, you can take it. I'd assume you're the monster hunter that folks have been expecting, so, uh, a weapon like this could come in handy. <laughs> yeah. 
Alright, Sergeant Flint, you're a little lazy, man. Using the water tank to put out the fire. Pure genius. <laughs> Here, take old bug spray. Cause of this chaos. I don't want to see it anywhere near here again. Shoot dang. Oh, did he give it to me? I thought it was in here. All right, nice. Let's go to the mine. Oh my god. Thanks, Bronster. Does anyone have a smooth way of removing the marker? I regret ever placing one on the map. The game looks so good, and it just... It just irks me to see it, man. Seems like the only way really is to delete the actual save file of the waypoint. There's a save file waypoint? I delete the PNG. Charles! Are you out there? Oh. You know, I, I kind of respect it, but also don't know how I feel about the fact that the main monster is shown right away in the tutorial, <laughs> and then... And then, like, so now you've seen him, you know? <laughs> and you have no wonderment about it. And then you go to fight goons in the... In the, um... Coal mine. Oh yeah, kinda like Skyrim. <laughs> While mining the I bet you, I bet you the goons are dead. There's something else down here. While mining the furthest tunnel, we broke through a wall into a large cavern. There's something strange here, and we don't know what it is. We're requesting that Mr. Warren visit the southern mine site at his earliest convenience to give us further instruction. Eugene, team supervisor. Am I south? I am south. Lean to spy on enemies and avoid being spotted. Oh. Wait, what? Eugene? Is this the old guy? But they said that the mob had taken... The mob is hiding an important egg in the southern line. Okay. I thought that that was the team supervisor for the mob.
Oh, nice. I'm good at these. <laughs> ah, I can customize my train color. Humming? It seems too easy. Someone's whistling. Oh shit! Oh shit! Should it be here? Oh, I know! See ya! here <laughs> he comes whistling oh okay he's still coming oh, oh okay Machine gun! Until next time, Charles! Fuck, where are we? nice so oh just start right. did I remove it Dude, I almost died. Let's get some more speed going.
No, you can't remove it by reaching the waypoint. Come on, it's Eugene. He's alive. What's that sound? My goodness, the others have to convince him to come help us. I'm so glad you came. But I simply cannot stay any longer. This island is too much for my nerves to handle. I've brought all my belongings here so I can leave immediately when a boat arrives. Although now that I think about it, I did forget my journal at home. Could you bring it to me? It's a dangerous journey for sure, but you might manage with that train of yours. I'll give you all the scrap metal I have. Just please, bring the journal next time you're here. This guy wants me to risk my life for a journal? He does seem like the rich type. Might be worth. The horror action game? Uh, yes. One person on the forum said to place a waypoint in the black of the map as far away as you can. No. No, it doesn't work. <laughs> I, I'd rather just have it over here. <laughs> what is it about this waypoint that frustrates me so much? <laughs> is there something about it? <laughs> Alright, so this is the journal... Weapon mission. Or we could go left. No, not right now. We're gonna, let's go down here. We got a required mission, a weapon mission, and an optional. Journal's over there. We could get that when we come here. And an optional. Okay, cool. I wonder what other kind of uh, things there are on here. Eugene mentioned that there's more than just Charles. Would it allow me to do this? Is it that realistic that it won't? Ah, okay, cool. If you were to have your own color, what would it be and what would you name it? I'd choose green. I just name a green, man. It's a good name for green. I can't think of a new color. All the colors have already been invented, or not like invented, but like the. I can't just come with something new. <laughs> I... <laughs> Invented. <laughs> I'm, I really misunderstand how colors work. <laughs> oh, God damn. I'm stuck debating if Warren made us bring our families to this hellhole so that we never le need to leave. 
or to keep information about his business practices away from the mainland. Either way, I want that man in a noose. Paul asked me to design a new weapon for the monster hunter that Eugene is sending, and knowing what I do about explosives, you can bet I made the most powerful rocket launcher I could. Warren, you don't stand a chance. Paul asked me to design a new weapon to help you hunt Charles, and using my- I've been wanting to see Warren's empire crumble for a long time. So building this puppy was a hell of an opportunity. Now that you're here, I need a few minutes to remove some safety features. While I'm working on that, why don't you bring that box of rocket ammunition back here from inside the bunker? This guy's ready to fight. All suddenly stretching. Is that it? Failed, failed, 13 second flight, success. Okay, nice. Launcher is in complete working order. Oh, and take good care of it. After you're done, I have a few people to visit with it if you catch my drift. <laughs> I'm just gonna murder a couple of people. You know how it is. You think that voice actor's a YouTuber? Oh, come. This looks ominous. I need you to write this theory down before Warren finds out that I'm onto his dirty plot. My theory is that Mr. Warren, Warlord III, is trying to hatch and raise more of these eight-legged critters. A whole army for who knows what purpose. They found a whole nest of those eggs while clearing out debris from the cave -in. We also know that they're as hard as diamonds, completely indestructible. The miners spent months using the temple prism to suck the energy out of all the eggs, but before they could destroy the last three, old man Warren stopped them. Warren must have realized how powerful these things are, and rather than protect us from them, once us wants to use them to take over the world. I'm on to you, Warren. Greg, genius extraordinaire. Chat, watch this guy have that exact voice. I I'm sure Eugene told you all about me, so I need not introduce myself. Never mind. <laughs> not the vibe I was expecting. <laughs> it's okay, he's, he's more of a genius. He sounds more the, of a genius than I than I expected. Name's Greg, by the way. In case you haven't heard, I'll 
already Warren, the mine boss, is keeping three monster eggs locked away. We're unsure why he wants to protect the eggs. If they hatch, they would surely turn into monstrous creatures like Charles. To prevent this, we, we need you to steal all three and, and use them to bait Charles. I know, I'm already working on that. One of the eggs is, is ah, the north mine. perfect, thank you. Here's, here's the key to the entrance. I see. I don't know why he's naked. You know what I find funny? This whole Lizard King drama. I love how much all these YouTubers are milking it. And like, they'll, they'll mention, don't get me wrong, they'll mention it in the video that, like, nobody actually thought that he wasn't on steroids. Is his, is his name not Lizard King? Liv- <laughs> Liv- <laughs> Liver King. Liver, uh... I forgot the point I was gonna make. <laughs> anyway, um, it's just the shittest drama, man. In terms of drama that we've had from YouTubers and streamers, this one is the least entertaining. Nobody, nobody's surprised, you know. Like, I don't know. On a rating of 1 to 10, I rate this drama a solid 2 and a half. Not very entertaining. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> okay. Ocean Watch. Wait, hold on. It's a woman. Ocean, ocean. Well, I can't, I, I mean, I can't do any woman voice. I'll try as close as I can. I went outside to do a routine check of the lighthouse. As I walked around the corner of the building, I saw that beast, Charles. He spotted me and charged straight up the hill in my direction. That spider train is a hideous monster. I can't understand why Warren wants us to stay on Raneareum instead of trying to escape the beast. I suppose Warren has simply gone crazy, thinking he can handle the situation on his own. In any case, Charles ran right over me, trampling my leg. I won't be able to attend the upcoming meeting and ask Greg to bring back a copy of your notes, if possible. Please deliver a copy to Paul. Oh, Greg is the guy we just met. The Andrew Tate looking guy. We haven't met, but I've heard lots about you coming to help us. I couldn't do this. I have a favor to ask. The breakers on the side of the lighthouse need replacing. I was recently attacked by Charles, so I'm unable to do it myself. The breakers are in the nearby supply shed. If you go get them and repair the lighthouse, yeah, it's just, just generic woman voice. Come help us. Once you finish, <clears throat> I have some spare scraps to give you. I'm gonna, tonight when I go to bed, start laughing randomly at <laughs> remembering that.
fixing the lighthouse will definitely increase our chances of being spotted. Here are those scraps I promised. Cheers, bae. Oh, I like the green. It stands out. Huh, that's a whole lot of ground without any NPC on the way. I wonder how this is gonna go. Surely Choo Choo Charles doesn't show up through these like 1,000 meters. The Boomer. Come on, Charles, come get it. Tasty piece of train meat. Where are you? Where are you, you bastard? Santiago. They come with a function so you can whistle for your train to come. Like a little puppy. Fuck, where did I park it? How did he forget his journal when it's just laying on his desk? There's a theory, <clears throat> which I've forgotten about right now, which says that if you have a big open field and you're going down it, let's say you're driving a motorbike or you're on a sled down a hill, and there's if you drive if you're on a sled down a snow hi snowy hill, and it's completely clear, but there's one tree across 50 meters. I don't know what the word for this theory is, but there, there's some sort of theory that, like, humans will subconsciously go towards it, even if they don't want to. It's something like that. I watched a gif just yesterday um, of a kid who was going to jump across a, an opening, and it's completely clear for him to run, and it's just a one-meter jump, nice and easy, but there's one little piece of cable or something just on one spot, and he fully runs over that and trips off of that and falls down. And it was super easy for him to avoid. It's the one thing he had to avoid and he ran straight over it and tripped. Um, I, but yeah, I believe it's, yeah, it's a well-known effect on motorcycles. Yeah, I believe it's like a traffic thing. I believe I learned it regarding traffic. It's some sort of theory around traffic that like, if you have an open, you will hit the thing. It's something like that. Target fixation, yeah. Perhaps that's what it is. I find it very interesting, even though I don't remember anything about it. Q. 
Humans are perplexing people. Can't read it. No, I'd say it's almost the opposite of tunnel vision. <laughs> <coughs> That was Charles. Ran into a loop. Ah! Ah! Say hello to the boomer! Oh, I missed. Get off my track! I'm dead! I gotta- Go! Go! More speed! More speed! Okay. Where are we? What the fuck? Where am I? What happened to me being over here? I was meant to- It's okay. We'll go here. We'll make it back. That's close. Eugene? Is he even needed? We'll call this Eugene's Bend. Be the archivist that Eugene told us about. Oh, it's um, ooh, um, the the guy, uh, 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 uh um, the uh, the big, the, 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 he looks like the, he reminds me of the bigger guy from the Trip Become Human. Oh, never mind. Mad, mad never mind. The voice went kind of deep now, like even more. You know, that old train of yours will need some major upgrades if you want to take down Charles. There are some metal never mind. I was completely off. <laughs> you could use to this wasn't how he introed it. Here's the key to the barn. It's just up the path, but I'll mark it on your. 
he he went full redneck halfway th or just just after the intro it just it's, it completely <laughs> changed the, my mind <laughs> Thanks, mate. I tell you, these are some lame ass mini missions so far. So side missions? Mini missions? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, lame ass side missions. Even though Eugene has promised to send help once he reaches the mainland, I've just realized he never mentioned if he'd return. I suppose he's the type of person to ignore the fine details of a plan. Everyone on the island is trying to find a way out of this mess, and I can only hope that this archivist friend of his can work some magic. Am I the archivist friend? I don't care what strange things they've done before or what practices they use as long as Charles ends up dead. Most folks around here want the same, but then there are those crazies that want to leave him be. That Don Warren has lost his marbles. What do we think? Chicken feed, goat feed, fencing supplies, well scratch all that. No need to feed or fence animals that have already been eaten. What do we think? How close am I to, to the real deal? <clears throat> it's not goofy. You sound like my She's gonna sound crazy. Why, how do you do? Or something like that. I need my pickles! <laughs> I ate the last jar of pickles I had in my house. And there's only one jar of pickles left on the island. My secret <laughs> jar of pickles. Locked away inside my pickle cave. I would have gotten them hours ago, but I lost my pickle cave. <laughs> Someone else on the island might have some lock pickles. I mean, lock picks. And if you can bring me my <laughs> okay. special jar of pickles, I'll give you all the scrap metal I have as a reward. Pickles are the love. Pickles are the life. I love the pickles. They make me feel the happiness. Pickles, pickles, pickles. Her name's Pickles? Was her name Pickles? Oh. 
Pickle, pickle, pick, 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 pickles. Okay, so... Return to the pickle lady to complete your mission. I feel like there's meant to be an encounter here, no? These side missions don't seem very special if I'm just running out here and doing this. There's no... Scared? There's- I'm not scared because nothing's happening. <clears throat> well, nothing's happened so far. I should say. Like, it has me run all the way out here, and I don't meet Charles? Can you only meet Charles on the train? That surprises me. Unless, of course... It's RNG, and I'm just having, like, bad luck with meet, uh, m meeting him. Alright, here we go. This is by far my favorite comment <laughs> regarding Pickle Lady. Pirates leave wrote, <laughs> I can fix her. <laughs> so funny, dude. God, that's good. <laughs> so, it's the full stop that makes it, man. <laughs> I love that. Right. Where did I go left last time? Maybe here? Did I fight for that long? Ah! Oh, okay. All the sounds. Maybe it switches every time. Oh fuck, yeah, I was meant to go left there. I don't know why I decided to go out here. Wait, why is he here? 
This seems glitched. Why would he be up here? He's meant to be down at... Has that not updated? Wasn't he down here? I'm a little confused. Oh shit! Stop the train! Go back! Who's this? Haven't I already done this guy? You're that monster oh, hunter. Sasha. Hello. I must know. Do you have any experience with ghosts? Someone or something has been painting exactly 16 drawings to lampposts in the boulder field every night. I always collect and burn them, but as I was looking for them last night, I began hearing strange noises and seeing strange things. I only found half of them yesterday because of the commotion. Could you go find the last date and bring them to me? What? This seems like such a pointless mission. You really want me to go do this? Reminds me of, um, is it Slenderman that has the pages? Or is it something else? What? <laughs> That's a ghost? What the fuck? What the hell? Okay. What? Where am I? Yeah, we're playing a quick, uh, there he is. Uh, quick Slenderman game. <laughs> He's like floating in a, an invisible train. Ah, oh, fuck, there's one down there. How big is this area? I can't tell where I've been and where I haven't. left.
Ta-da! That was too bad. Uh, Miserere, thanks for the tier 3, uh, resub. Welcome back. I honestly feel like Choo Choo Charles is a little bit uh, underutilized so far. I, I, uh, maybe not. But I feel like everything except for Charles is just not Thanks. holding quality. Here are some scraps for your help. Thanks. You know what I mean? Charles is amazing. Really well done. <clears throat> that part is great. But nothing else is happening here. To be honest with you, you're just unlucky. Another stream had more encounters with them. Am I just unlucky enough to have one of the most boring playthroughs? <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> Where the fuck is that dock? I don't see any icon. Is that him? No? Oh, here he is. Alright, we'll do that later. Alright, let's go over here. Alright, stick to the right. Thanks, Outway. Yeah. Yeah, it was a bit sad to not be able to celebrate with anyone. Bad seat, bad seat. Through the new Pokestop map, Dracula's Castle. Dracula's Castle. Are you talking about the one that came a few months ago? Yeah, we're uh, we're already playing through that. Don't tell me you're talking about an another new map. That sounds like the Halloween one, Dracula's Castle. Out there. There he is. What? No, wait, that's. Is that even him? I think so. He comes! But I have to. You fucking asshole! I'm at the mine! Why now? Thank you.
See the rating IGN gave this game to you? No, what did they give it? <laughs> what did they give it? <laughs> Four out of ten. That's a little harsh, to be honest. Game is not a four out of ten. Make sure nobody goes near the egg. If you see anyone that shouldn't be there, shoot them immediately. Notice can be taken. As soon as I finish the collect, bring the body to me. Warren. What's the name? Warren the Conqueror the Third or something like that? He had a really stupid name. The Warlord. Oh, okay. Hey! Ah! Why wasn't this guy whistling? That's what scares me the most, some dude? Was he whistling? Was there two different whistlers? I only heard the- whistling for ages? No, but that was a different guy! There were two guys! The one whistling was the other guy. No? Or? <laughs> and I scream. Oh, what's down there? Secrets? Scrap. There's probably gonna be an NPC there later, maybe? I can whistle two times at once, yeah. But uh, you won't hear it on the mic. Oh, this guy's gonna be like, um... Hey. Can you do me a favor? It's gonna be something like that. Hey. Stakeout summary, day three, location four. I've been staking out these... Maybe with a, a hinge of... I've been staking out this area for days. And Charles has never crossed the old wood bridge. Somehow that beast... <clears throat> he's cunning enough to know it's dangerous, but if he is crazy and desperate, he might just chase someone across it. Then BAM! We use John's bold bombs to blow the whole thing up, and Charles falls flat first into the canyon. If the blast doesn't kill him... <laughs> I feel like it's changed. The fall surely will. Watch. Your 
were the archivists my father told me about. Never mind. Also, who says archivist? Although, I'm disappointed to see that he chose to stay on the mainland rather than return with you. Not to say that your help isn't appreciated. Oh, it's Paul! Could have used his aid as well. If you haven't already, do we know Paul? Others, the mine boss Warren is protecting dangerous monsters. He was referenced earlier. Paul's not the son, no. While our main plan is to summon Charles into a duel and fight him to the death, we've devised a perfect trap as a precaution that may help defeat him. Go attach these remote explosives to each of the support pillars under the wood bridge out there. Then meet me back here. I knew there was something to do with that bridge. Yeah, Paul's the son, right? Because he was like, well, I don't know why my dad went out there. Um, I'm surprised I'm not telling him that his dad's his dad was brutally murdered in front of my very own eyes. Am I missing something? Let's do it from up there. Is Paul Pickle Lady's uh, husband? No, stop. No, he's not. are saying that Charles can in fact attack you when you're not in your train, but I I seem to be having a bad seed here. He hasn't attacked me once. Mutiny mutiny notes. I have discussed our latest battle plan with everyone, and nobody had objections. The whole crew knows what to do and will set the net tracks directions accordingly when the time comes. All the archivist needs to focus on is pummeling that beast, keeping his distance, and getting Charles to his weakest point. My father shall be back within- Oh, this is the guy from upstairs. My father shall be back within two days, at which point we can supply him and the hunter with the keys and other supplies we gathered. We never wanted to take such harsh action against Warren and the other miners, but he's twisted our arms too long. Charles needs to go, and Warren won't stand in our way. That's the tallest and weakest bridge on the island. So if Charles ever crosses it, we can blow him. Oh, are there multiple up. endings? Can I'll I choose whether detonate the charges? But it's still up to you to summon and fight him. Here, take this. It's the key to the temple. What? Once you think you're prepared enough, you can break in and fight the battle of a lifetime. Paul, which one is it, man? Am I fighting at the temple and killing him there, or am I bringing him here? It seems to be both, right? I'm fighting him at the temple, and then I'm coming here to kill him. It'd be kind of cool if you got to choose. I'd be down for that. Whether you want to do it the magical way at the temple, or... Finish it? Oh yeah, I need the third egg though. Let's go to the next weapon. I don't mind the side mission so much. Hey! She's uh, hey, hey! So the fabled hunter has finally Never mind. arrived. You know, my late husband built a gun to help fight Charles, but Warren's goons stole the barrels and took him up to their camp. Bob was such a brave man. Much braver than you, I bet. 
Take what I have left to the gun and steal back those other parts. Just do me one favor. Well, if you do end up using it, name it Bob in memory of my honey. Oh, cute. Jesus, okay. I don't I don't really mind all the side missions. Uh, if there was some action during it. <laughs> Ends up just feeling like a side mission simulator. Sermon Atline. God is very, very mad, I think, probably. Charles may be devil, 96% certain. Always sneaky. Spider versus snake. Spiders have more legs, usually. God always wins, hopefully. Sacrifices. Ask for volunteers. Don't cry a lot. Only a little. <laughs> a little. A, li a little. A <laughs> little. Closing prayer. Clean up. Yo, they're looking for sacrifices? What's this snake they're talking about? To Mr. Reverend. Today's sermon was a true inspiration during these trying times. Very well thought out, and thorough in every manner. I believe I speak for the whole congregation when I say that we admire your confidence and steadfast wisdom as we grieve our lost brothers and sisters. <laughs> Forrest Gump. No, it's good. It's a good, uh, good accent. Howdy. What do you need, stranger? The Archivist, in all your radiant glory. Nice. I nailed it. Paul entrusted me with a key to one of the mines containing an egg. But before I give it to you, I have to warn you about something. There's an ancient shrine on the island. A pyramid of sorts, with a curious prism located at the top. The prism seems to have been designed for one purpose. To destroy monster eggs. Three slots are carved into the prism, which perfectly fit the eggs. When fully loaded, Massive beam of energy is emitted, seemingly drawn from the eggs themselves. The mutineers hope this event will lure Charles to. Yes, I mean I know about this. Comes in defense of the eggs. Now for the real warning. Charles has the ability to Ooh. absorb energy from the burst, strengthening and enraging him. We saw it once before. He may become even more dangerous this time. What? It's not my place to oppose, despite the danger. So here's the mind key. Once you have retrieved all the eggs and the key to the shrine. Just be able to end this hell. At last, oh fuck. At last night's meeting, Greg told us a crazy conspiracy about Warren trying to use spider trains for world domination as part of the crew that worked in the temple. I'm far from convinced. While the prison was extracting the life energy from a batch of eggs, Charles attacked us for the first time. Not only did he fight like hell while the eggs were being destroyed, but he nearly doubled in size as he fought. As if he were consuming the energy, his legs grew larger and stronger while his face grew more distorted right before our eyes. Those of us who survived couldn't even fathom what we witnessed. That, that was when Howard Warren hid the eggs and ordered us to protect them. That was when he began evacuating people. That was when everything turned for the worse. I know Warren has plenty of skeletons in his closet, but I can't help thinking he might actually be looking out for us this time. I'm excited to meet Warren. So, where to? There's the last egg. Mob camp in between Warren's mob still. Oh, that's the new weapon. All right, cool. And the rest are just um, for more scraps. It would be nice to finish Santiago's mission, which we can technically get to. What's this? Oh, that's the finishing. Okay. Left, right. This game is weird. I don't know how I feel about it. I think, I think for me, I just think Charles is pretty underutilized. <clears throat> when you first enter the island, uh, the guy talks about all other kinds of things as well. 
He insinuates that there's more... You fucking prick. He insinuates there's more to the island than Charles. But so far, all there's been is Charles and a ghost. <clears throat> and I think that is probably where the game kind of loses it at some points for me. No, not now, man. Can, can you not? <laughs> I complain I don't want to see him. Right after saying I want to see him. Uh, he's just kind of being sneaky, I think. And that's how it's done. You see, that gameplay is fun. I think uh, the the train combat is a little underutilized. the new parts are. I thought this was the... Yeah, this is a new gun. Acquired. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. That's in case <laughs> Charles comes in flying. <laughs> Honk if you're horny! This doesn't look like the entrance of a mine. It's down here. We tried and we failed. 
By the time we managed to clear the wreckage, everyone had already passed. I'm sanded, truly distraught. I thought of these men like brothers, causing these circumstances to cut deeper than I could ever have imagined. What? Oh. Hello, Tom. I'm good. How are you? Okay. <laughs> How do I get back up? Charles, I hear. Beat it, right on me. Alright. I, I was trying to think of where the train was. I mean, like, I don't know, I lost one scrap. It teleports me to my train, and I get to keep the egg. Like, what? It's kind of worth it, no? <laughs> like, you would think it at least makes me do the, uh, the mine again. You know, <laughs> like, I really didn't lose anything from that. Where's, where's the punishment?
You see, that was scary. I wish I would have met him more in my playthrough. <laughs> I do kind of want to go to Santiago. Uh... I have to go a very far way to get to Santiago. So, let's get going. Fuck! It's small. I've been watching your vids on Overwatch and was checking in to see if you'd be interested in. Coaching from a board collegiate league coach. What's a collegiate? Uh, no thank you. It's a very nice offer though. What, what do you do? I don't understand. Dude, is Overwatch like a thing in college? Like esports? College esports? That's nice. That's fun. Makes sense since they have all, ki all kinds of sports at them. What? Oh yeah, of course. Ooh. Um. Eugene's curve. You think he's still here? Eugene's bend. I think he's been eaten. He's in front of me. Okay. What, uh... Okay. Fuck, I have to get out. It's the wrong direction. He's chill, though. goal of this game I just joined. I'm uh, a guy who's been uh, brought to this island to help them defeat an evil train by the name of Charles. It's like a spider train. This is a witch. Howdy doodly. That's gonna be her name. Uh, her, um, her voice. It's gonna be kind of raspy and like. Well, hello darling. Knew it. Lisbeth Merkwater. I'm making a fresh stew with ingredients for my very own swamp. But I don't have any meat at the moment. I smell a carcass on the island in the swamp, 
And if you wait over there and bring it back for me, I'll pay you some scraps. Although, you'll need to be wary of Barry, the swamp monster. Keep an eye out for him splashing around. And don't move if he gets close to you. As long as you stand still, he's as kind as a kitten. Swamp water. Oh god, I've lost my voice. Salt, clover, dirt, salt, meat. Any kind. Human included. <laughs> That's it? They just want me to go there? I'm kind of curious, actually. Ah! How do I lose more scraps from dying by this random swamp monster than I do by from dying by um, uh, fucking Thomas the Tank Engine? Charles. Or does it go up every death? That could be it. That would be a good theory. I have to go get the fish again. I wish that happened uh, with the third egg. What? What do you mean by folded pizza, Taco Man? I'll cut up my pizza into slices, and when I eat a slice, it I I fold it a little in my hands for sure. Maybe not all that, not maybe not every bite, but I usually fold it up a little, or not fold it up. I just you know, put my finger down the middle and. Yeah, so it'll be a little folded, perhaps.
we'll play Rainbow Six again someday. Um, probably not. Eat it the Trumpway from the crust. What? <sighs> the Z pizza from the crust. Is that confirmed? There's no way. He'll have done- that'll just been a publicity stunt. If there was ever anything that a politician should lose followers for, it's if he was eating pizza from starting with the crust. It's a reference from a Pizza Hut commercial in the 90s. Ah, okay. To be fair, I could defend eating pizza starting with the crust. Hear me out. It could be seen as the same logic as when you eat, like, some sort of bun that has, like, the best part in the middle. You chew all the sides first and save the best part to last. Right? And I could see the idea behind doing it with pizza slices. You do the crust first so that you get all the juicy pizza last. Not saying that it's worth it, but I could see myself doing it with the last slice. With the last slice, I could see myself eating half of it, and then turning it around, eating the crust, so that I end with the juicy, cheesy pizza part. So that the last thing my tongue will know and remember is the pizza itself, rather than the crust. What a delicacy you found! Here but there's no point in doing it for the rest of the pizza. Have a safe... Is that a train whistle? It is. Run. Run. How do I how do I how do I do this though? I finally get to meet him out here. No? Yes. Charles, I want you to come. idea for a monster. He just... That was the first time that he's kind of been in the distance <clears throat> during a side mission, other than the time where he killed me in the last one. But like the first two hours of the game, he never showed up other than when I'm in the train. Oh, who's that? Wait, hold on. Oh, it's someone I've already done. I gotta try out Bob on you. Charles! Watch the Kingdom Two Crowns VOD. Wonder if you and Flash were going to continue playing it again at some point because I really enjoyed it. Yeah, we are. Definitely this week. Thanks for the five dollars. I lack sleep. 
wish I could disable this map uh, transition. Quickly! Sayonara, kid. Yeah, I'd love to be able to chase him. Thank you so much for bringing my journal. I would hope, for your own good, that you didn't peek inside. But, um, here are those scraps I promised. Why? green for life. Unless of course they had rainbow, that'd be nice. <sighs> okay, I'll go here. I can do this one, and that one, and then we'll finish the game. Hi, Arne. What's up, buddy? Be good if Charles set up traps like steel-like webbing. Ooh, yeah. I agree. That would have been cool. Now, if I went back, I think... I couldn't choose that other path. I considered it, but there was no switch on it. So... It's fine. I'm almost there. Been to the US before, so what's your favorite place you've been? I have been to LA a couple times. I was in New York when I was a kid, as well as Texas. When I was a kid and we were that same trip when we were in Texas, I think I went to Six Flags. That was pretty cool. I 
did indeed go all the way to LA to look at the wrong camera. You are correct. Thanks for reminding me. And your favorite place to travel worldwide? Uh, I am a big fan of Thailand. I think that Thai people are really some of the kind well, what are you doing here man Thai people are um, some of the kindest people that I have met they're very it's very kind while you have money. What kind of fucking <laughs> comment is that? Makes them sound like such simpletons, man. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you could say the same about most countries in terms of service. If you're talking about people in service, then... Um, it's hard as a tourist to gauge how someone is, or how people in a country are. Is this a side mission? Oh, it's this. This is the end game? I- oh. Alright, we're doing the main mission. <laughs> I thought I went- I must have taken the wrong turn. <laughs> well, I don't have any scraps to heal my train. <laughs> It's Warren Charles. You don't know what you're doing. Just put the egg down slowly and lay flat on the ground. You'll hurt far too many people if you follow through with whatever you're planning. No! No! You that is one fool. budget Heisenberg, man. Heisenberg! Oh, okay. Oh, shit, okay. Yeah. Let's do this, Hell Charles! Have a taste of Bob! Give him a lick! Fire!
Bob sucks! It's a controllable cutscene. This is the last stop. <laughs> That's nice. God, millions of Charles. Choo choo, bitches. See what this uh, mission that I missed was. What did you guys think of the game? I like to look at this like a proof of concept. Get the funding and a big team behind this, and the follow up will be huge. Oh, yeah, okay. That's a cool way of looking at it. How much was this game? 20 bucks. You know, I, 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 I thought it was fun. I think, um... It could have used another six months in the oven. And what I mean by that is, um... What I mean by that is, I, I don't think it was buggy, I just think it needed a little more content. The side missions were a little boring. Um, the, the couple times that I met Charles out in the open as I'm running around were really scary. But, uh, 
It only happened like twice. I think it needed some more... The, the amount of effort that he's clearly put into Charles, I think needed to have been put into other monsters. Dude, Charles and the animation with him and everything feels like... It just feels on a whole other tier compared to, like, the ghost I ran into and the swamp monster. This game could be... and I, So I, I think it's not scary enough. I think it could have been way scarier if, if, if I feel haunted when I'm out here. But I don't. Give me a couple of different guns that I could use to get him off me here, and uh, I think I'd enjoy it. Uh, Holy fella! Hey, oh, aren't you the new guy who's come here to work for us? I'm just seeing what this was because I missed it. You must be. There's something at the top of these towers that I need. And don't worry, I won't make you work for free. I'm a nice enough guy to pay you. You see, Mr. Warren never told anyone from the mainland about his mining operation. He never even reported the cave-in. He hasn't paid us since then. Top it all off? None of us miners ever. I'm gonna sue the pants off the Warren once I escape this island, and I need those files to prove he keeps all his files at the top of these towers. Problem is, he erected these towers years before we ever started mining. I could scale them myself as a reward. <laughs> yeah, you see, these side missions don't do it for me. This is probably one of the better ones, if I have to hop around in parkour. But they just feel very... eh, you know? Cool. I give it... I give it a... 5.8 out of 10. <laughs> I give it a 6. We'll, we'll run it off at a nice solid 6. The, the... Thomas... No, why do I keep calling him Thomas? Charles saves it for me. Charles, uh, Charles saves it. But, um, yeah, it wasn't scary enough, in my opinion. 